Hello everybody, Robin United Footy here and today it is time for another match day experience here on Robin United Footy channel. Over there we took on Oxford United at New York Stadium and we won 2-1 by um, Edmonds Green and Dan Ballasol took the penalty for Rotherham which I am so happy about over there with massive three points as well over there. And also Dan Barnesell scored an old goal for Oxford and all. So anyway, uh, let's move on to today. Today is the another away trip of three Tuesdays in a row now. This is the last Tuesday of three in a row now. Last two weeks we've been to Pompey and we went to Burton last week. And now this week we travel to Sunderland at Stadium of Light today to take on Rotherham United in Sunderland today. My score prediction is going to be a tough one. I hope we win. I'm thinking 1 0 to the Millers tonight. I think uh, my uncle Smith will score tonight. I think so. Today, I am going with the Bridget coaches from Dropping Well today, as you've seen on Portsmouth video, as you've seen before. So, uh, anyway, then, guys, uh, enjoy the video, and I will see you all in a bit. And it's our favourite one. If you want to get it out to play now, Barnes is relegated to blah blah blah. Let's. We didn't know. Do you know what I mean? I'll still wear my Barnes and shirt with pride. Right, the place we're going to is Durham, I believe. Where I drop it off is where I pick you up, and I believe there's a weather spoon that's very close by to it, okay? So it'd be a couple of hours up to, up to Durham. There you go. Yeah. Exit the roundabout onto the slip road.
ね。So today is stopping place, we're stopping at Durham. That is Durham. Let's lift to Lellingham level. What's it called? Walker Gate. What is that then? Upstairs. It's not on there anywhere, is it? We are here. Yeah, but which place we're going to? We're in here. How do you know where we're going? Our Dave's behind. Yeah, but how does Dave know where we're fucking going? I don't know. I don't know I'm, I'm just trusting Tommy. Yeah. Are you sure it's four or five? We will be, yeah. But I didn't see that weather swung's on that list. Strange, he said that. Coach. Oh, well, he didn't realise what we said, did he? A few dicks on today. Yeah. Which side will it he be? Tell me, Paul, so they couldn't get them who are booked on. Behind me. It's not even a four regulars, is it? Aha! Yeah, it's not mine to be an Told you, Dad, we took it all away. What's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? Oh, it's a massive one. Ah, give us a tip. Doors are locked. Doors are locked. Doors are locked. We're having a disco, we're having a disco, la 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 We're in the No Weather Spoons today called the Bishop Mill in Durham. So when we come up in the lift, we came out of them doors right there. Never walked along that way. So anyway, I'm going to go back in there now.
is. Oh, it's no all this, though, isn't it? Um, yeah, it does. There it is. Number one. Number one, is it? That's it. You tell him, you give him a ring to the coach, man, to pull up, come up that side and put it <laughs> I've seen some of you just getting full on, pints. Man. I know it's Fucking well, honestly, just getting full pints at this time. So, well. Then they'll fucking annoy everybody then. No, that's what I mean, I thought, well. There it is. So we were just basically sleeping, just been through there, just come out of there, I went up there. Yeah. In 200 yards, use the left lane to take the A1. In 100 yards, at the roundabout, take the third exit onto Borgs Brewery Way. In a quarter of a mile, turn left. Minute. Just pace that down, we're not getting off here, mate. Please, we're not with us now. Turn left, then your destination will be right, on the left. Big game as well, guys. Come back down, and the quicker we all get on, the quicker we can vacate Sunderland for three points. Come on, way to go.
but a stupid free kick to get away that. Ross Stewart.
Hello guys, it's time to end this match day experience from last night. Well, it was a good night last night. I was pleased with a point last night, but I was a bit disappointed without the three points. Anyway, let's talk about the night trip to Sunderland we did last night. Yesterday, I travelled with the bridging coaches from Droppingwell and Bridging. And then we left there, we travelled on M1 motorway, then we went up A1. We had to dive it a little bit because there were an accident on A1 so we cut it all off back onto A1 and then we stopped off at Durham last night first time in my life I visited Durham what do I think to Durham really nice place actually so we went to Weatherspoons called the Bishop's Mill last night you might have seen the lift video because we were a long long way up them steps it were like six flights of steps it were so yes, uh, we had a, an hour in Weatherspoons, had some food and drinks. I had a bit of a walk around, taking some pictures and videos. So we left Durham at quarter past six. Then we headed to Sunderland. We're going to caught up with a little bit of traffic on the A19 carriageway to Sunderland. But we got there at the end. We arrived at Sunderland at five to seven. Then when we arrived at the ground, uh, I've got myself a Grogan, which unfortunately I can't show you because I haven't got it with me. Which is at my home, basically. I might show it here on Saturday video. So yeah, so we went in turnstiles and then we had to climb a lot and lots of stairs. I was out of breath time I got up to the top. Everybody were. It's like you castle away, in it? All them steps we did. So yeah, so we got into the stand five minutes later after climbing them stairs, sat in our seats, we watched both teams warming up, listening to music of course, and then the players come out, and what do I think to my match report? I think first off we were fantastic. Michael Wickery scored for Rotherham United, and then second half we were really tough. We were re brilliant all game last night, but sadly, towards the end of the game, own goal, couldn't help you about it. Michael Wakeway gave Sunderland an own goal. I was a little bit disappointed, 
but I'm very pleased with a point. Well, at least we didn't lose last night. So yeah, so after the game, we clapped them off, back down the stairs, back on the coach, and then we travelled home. I was back in Rotherham for half past 12 this morning. Right then guys, that is it for this video. Uh, next up for Rotherham United, chilling them away in Kent on Saturday. Half past 12 kickoff. Last day of season it is Saturday. This is when we find out if we go up or playoffs. I, I want to go up basically. So come on, let's go up on Saturday, Rotherham. I'm so excited. Hope this day on Saturday is going to be mental, isn't it? Uh, on Saturday, I will be going on a train for a change, like I did last time for Chillingham. Uh, this video can be quite a bit long because it's last day of season and you never know, it might go up anyway. It could be an hour long or something like that. So, anyway, then, guys, uh, that is it for this video. Right then, guys. Um... Please, Please like, like and, and subscribe, subscribe to Rotherham United, United Footy. Footy. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you all on Saturday when we travel to Chillingham in Kent. The upload will be on Sunday. So thank you very much for watching and I will see you all next time on Robin United Footy Channel. Goodbye.